Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having the most incredible day. Welcome to, can you see, Bogota, Colombia. Hello, hello, live from Bogota. Welcome back to my channel. Oh girl, not me dehydrated. If you are new, my name is Sebastian. I spill tea every single day. So if you're looking for a new messy best friend girl, you have found me. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. We have to talk about Britney and I feel like, yes, a lot of people are talking about Britney. I obviously you guys know that I love Britney and I have a lot of uh, thoughts about Britney but I just I was um I was packing which there was just mess everywhere but I was packing and um I came across Britney talk right Britney talk and the things that are being said about Britney even that she is dead is absolutely I wanted to find a bigger word and like a smarter more intellectual word for banana but like bananas are bonkers but like my intellectuality does not get that far but like it is insane right the amount of entitlement that Britney's some Britney Spears fans have because Britney Spears doesn't post a certain thing, because Britney Spears doesn't do certain things, because Britney Spears doesn't do what they want her to do so that they know that she is okay is insane. The same people that fought for her freedom to get her away from the people who were controlling her are the same people who are saying, why doesn't Britney Spears show more? Why doesn't she go more on her Instagram? Why doesn't she tell us that she is safe? I just want her to tell me that she is safe so I can know that she is safe. So I know that she is okay. Why does Sam do this? How come he doesn't show her so we know that she is okay? How come she is still in her living room? How come she... Girl, what? Absolutely not. That is such entitlement. Britney Spears doesn't owe you anything. She doesn't owe me nobody anything. She's finally free from the hell that she was in for 13 years. And you people are putting her back into this hell. Because you want to control. You want to ask questions. You want to conspiralize over everything she does. Because the bitch spins 5,000 times. Oh girl, she is not okay. Because Sam doesn't show her in the video. Oh girl, she is not free. Because she uh, deletes and posts. Girl, she is not fine. Because she calls somebody. Girl, send her. Mm -mm. What? The bitch can't wake up in peace because people are like, girl, she woke up on another side of the bed. What does this mean? Does this mean that Sam is not allowing her to sleep on the side that she wants to sleep in? Please, Brittany, let us know that you're sleeping on the side that you want, that you want to sleep in. I, when will this end? Now, I saw this TikTok about, about, and I'm so sorry, I'm calling her. She seems like she has a lot of time on her hands. She analyzes every, and I'm not even going to put her name or anything because I'm not going to give her any kind of attention. But she posts, she makes videos about everything. I, she, she'll maybe post five videos on one Britney Spears post. She will zoom in. She will zoom out. She will fucking analyze everything. Did you see that Britney Spears turned at a right degree angle at minute one second and 45 minutes of, of the video? What does this mean? Does this mean that she was trying to turn right at a 180 degree angle to let us know that she is spelling out the word help? I, what? Like, listen, I'll tell you something. And I'll tell you, girl, I look cute. Hey, I'll tell you something, right? I believe that Britney Spears fans, us, because I include myself, we love Britney. We want her to be happy. We want her to be hap happy and healthy and safe and blessed. But what if Britney doesn't want to be happy right now? What if Britney does not want to be a healing right now? What if she's pissed? What if she's a revengeful bitch right now? What if she wants to be mad as hell? What if she wants to call people out? What if she wants to stay in her house depressed day and fucking night? What if this is what she has to go through? And just because she is not acting or being the way you want her to be, people are, people are doing all these conspiracies. Girl, she didn't show her face. That doesn't sound like her. That's a, that's a robot. 
Britney Spears actually died. They're trying to take money from her. And and it, listen, if I wasn't such a petty bitch, I would show you the video so you can see who I'm talking about, but I can't. But there's just multiple videos. And there's this one video and she was like, girl, um, Britney Spears actually died and they're still benefiting from, from uh, all the money that it comes in, uh, uh, you know, that Britney earns. What exactly is Britney earning right now? There's no tours. There's no, I mean, there's the Elton John song, whatever. There's no, you know, there, there's really nothing huge going on. Now, in, I understand, like, Michael Jackson, you know, they bring out an album every other fucking month, right? So if Britney had, like, you know, if, there, if, if we would see so many products come out and come out and come out, I'd be like, okay, you know what? Yeah, I mean, who's really getting, I don't know, right? But, like, Britney's chilling in her house. Who's getting money? I mean, I'm sure she gets with residuals from things, but I, I don't think she's making that much money like if she was in, in, in a tour, right? I just feel like people need to calm down. People need to let her heal. They need to let her be. They need to let her fucking do 5,000 spins if she wants to. Guys, Britney Spears is not spinning the word help, okay? She is not. Now... Do, do, you know, she is on, on, um, you know, she's like on a, I believe she's not in a conservatorship anymore, but there's like this care plan, right? Now that, right, I think that, um, that might be, now I'm not, you know, the law, I'm not anything, so please don't, you know, obviously, I, I, I shouldn't even be mentioning this if I don't even know what I'm talking about, but what I believe is, I think that there's some sort of like, like a half halfway house is that what it's called correct me if i'm wrong um i think that britney shouldn't be under any kind of plan i think the only plan britney should be in is 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 her own <laughs> whatever she wants to plan maybe legally they wanted her to sort of like dip her toes back into freedom i have no idea but i don't know how that works so if you do know i'd love to learn but i just think that britney just needs to be right and i know that i also talk about britney and and things like that but i like to believe that i don't add to the conspiracies i i like to talk about what's going on in britney's life because you know what she is a public figure she's my favorite public figure and i like to be the voice of reason as much as i can to those out there who are making all these conspiracies and if you know my channel, you know that I like to believe in my heart that Britney is healing, that Britney is happy with Sam. But I have to tell you guys, after 13 years of abuse, and not only the 13 years, but before, because Britney's been working since, you know, there's probably so much more trauma even before the conservatorship. Um, I think that there's a lot of, of, of healing to be done. And I don't think that I don't think that you're going to get the shiny, happy Britney anytime soon. I think that Britney has a lot of anger, a lot of hurt, a lot of sadness inside that I think that she is dealing with in her own way. And I think that the reason that a lot of things shock us about Britney is because we are not used to seeing A, Britney like that, and B, we're not used to seeing really celebrities call other celebrities out or, um, you know be so real and raw and i think that is the main issue so i just i i don't know i get like i get it that people are worried and please show concern but to say she's dead to say that she is being held hostage in a i just i just think that's just so wrong you know it's obvious that britney spears needs to learn how to be human again you know she needs to be i mean imagine it's like a nine to five right like, like if we were gonna talk about like what we go through it's like a nine to five when you're in a nine to five you have your bosses and you have things and and even that when you get off work you're relieved because you don't have to act a certain way you can be yourself you don't have to you know listen and do whatever your boss wants that's just maybe like a milla, millisecond of what Britney went through, right? So if we feel desperation after after we're, we're clocking off from work. Imagine what Britney went through. So that's like times 500 million, right? 
So what do you guys think? Uh, obviously, look, I'm not in her life. You're not in her life. We don't really know what's going on. But what I do know is that we need to have faith that Britney's in the right path. And we have to stop wanting Britney to do things that we want her to do so that we can be at peace knowing that she is okay. She, again, does not owe us anything. Again, Britney Spears does not have to do or say or be whatever we want her to be. The entitlement needs to stop. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I love you guys so much. And here's a little more. Colombia. Encanto. Encanto.